Hello, Gemini. Welcome to Soul Sundays with Healing Dove Tarot. Gemini, if you follow my channel, you'll know that I mostly have focused on love readings and I'm now branching out doing generals. The only thing missing from Healing Dove Tarot is the healing. So every Sunday, I'm going to bring you a quick Soul Sunday update, just three simple cards for mind, body and soul. So let's get started. Universe and angels, messages and guides, my higher self, I call upon you now to give me a clear and accurate reading for the sign of Gemini. Please let me know what are the most important messages for mind, body and soul for them this week. Please let me know what they need to hear, not what they want to hear, starting with mind. That's too many. Just one card, please, spirit. Ace of Angels, oh, Gemini, this is beautiful, wisdom. Love and wisdom rain down upon you, bringing new ways to consider, perceive and create your life. Description. The beating of angel wings reflects the light into a flow of rainbows. That's a bit weird. Love is swooping in, bringing a breath of fresh air because someone has asked for change. New beliefs and ideas emerge as tiny sparks of illumination. The droplets crystallize as flashes of insight and clarity. These beautiful angel wings sweep away the veil of conformity to reveal a wealth of originality and innovation. The hearts motivate us to use the power of our thoughts for loving change. One is the number of initiation. This is the start of something new. It's pretty cool. And there's a meaning that goes with it. It says, The Ace of Angels opens your mind to new ideas and innovations. There are many truths and each is as valid as the next. You are coming to a deeper truth and seeing a situation with fresh clarity. This card may indicate a new course of study or a mental challenge that will push you to draw solutions from a broader perspective. You are ready to cut through a belief that no longer works for you. Combine intellect with your wisdom and all will be a breeze. You are in this slipstream of an angel's thoughts, ready to hear your ideas that resonate with your truth. Get ready for all that is coming by releasing what is never good and knowing what is good is just is. That's a bit weird, that last line. Um, the Rider Waite card in traditional tarot is the Ace of Swords. So the basic meanings of this are clear thought, purpose, triumph and spiritual truth. And Gemini, if I do remember correctly, I could be wrong, but I think I'm right. In the Gemini singles love reading for this week, I saw the Ace of Swords as well. So that's a repeating message for you, which is pretty cool. Okay, so that's for your mind, clarity, wisdom, beautiful. Let's have a look at the message for your body. It's the most important message for Gemini relating to their body for this week. Okay, Jesus the Divine Healer. So now obviously you all have your own faiths. This is, there's no judgment here. So take what you will and replace it with whoever you believe in. But I will read this to you exactly as the card is stated. Um, where is it? This card is a sign that Jesus' healing presence is with you or with a person that you're inquiring about. He brings non-denominational healing to all who call upon him. With unconditional love and forgiveness, your prayers for help have been heard and answered and his grace is supporting your peace and well-being. Teachings focused upon the healing power of faith. This card is also called to trust and have faith in miracles and blessings. And the key words are, Give any fears to who you believe, God or goddess. Ask Jesus to put your mind and body at ease, for peace is the foundation of health. Ask Jesus for guidance about what to do next and then listen to your intuitive wisdom. Read an inspirational passage about healing miracles and request that your faith be boosted. And then there's a prayer that goes with this and says, Dear Jesus, thank you for your divine healing power and presence. 
So I think that um, for anyone that's watching that doesn't have that faith, it's all about giving your trust in what you do believe in and who you do believe in and whichever God, goddesses, spiritual deity, the divine, I like to call it, or the universe is your truth. It's about giving your physical cares, whatever it is that you are struggling with at the moment, to, to them. Ask for help, in other words, right? Okay, soul. Let's have a look. Soul, additional guidance for Gemini. Soul love, what do they need to know this week? It's a lot of angelic guidance around you, Gemini. I'm just seeing angels, wings, you know, whatever you believe, you are spiritually guided, okay? I just want you to know that. And there's people looking out for you. Please show me one card for Gemini, soul love. Thank you, Eddie. Just one card. Space, space, space. Um, as per usual, the guidebooks, if you want to know what I'm using, um, are in the description below. Okay, look at the artwork on this. It's absolutely beautiful. And it says, give yourself or someone else the space to heal, think, create, and contemplate. Hold space as a gentle, non-judgmental, and supportive presence. Nothing needs to happen instantly. Pull back, trust, and respect the boundaries and processes of others. Pushing for a result will not get you to what you want in the long term. Choose your own destiny and let others choose theirs. And the spiritual meaning says, Across space and time, multidimensional worlds exist beyond human concepts of love, hate, right, and wrong. Bliss, creativity, and infinite peace are tucked away in the hidden dimensions of our souls where all is possible and all is welcome. Childlike innocence, curiosity, and a little dreaming are all it takes to reach these worlds. Close your eyes and be there. Wow, that's beautiful, Gemini. It's really telling you to kind of tap into your inner child. And if you meditate, it's about bringing joy back into your life. And I'm also being told um, laughter is really big for you this week. So get out, see a comedy, do something that brings you joy. I hope you found this reading helpful. If you did, please hit the like button and I'll be back with you next Sunday. Take care.